England only uses fabrics that have survived the extreme tests of the Olinator. I am the Olinator. Fabrics have to be tough to make it through me. I'm gonna mash some fabrics. I crush fabrics. I'm gonna torture some fabrics. <laughs> This is the Titan Universal Fabric Tester. We use this device to get an idea of how the fabric is going to perform in the home in use. It will pull the fabric to a certain pressure and it will even break the fabric. And this can be measured and understood so that we can apply it to the approval of fabrics for our product. After each 15,000 cycles, we will take a collection of any type of fibers, we'll make any kind of notes on separation of seam, or if any fiber has migrated through the fabric, and the samples that we take will be weighed and compared for acceptability. We run this test for 45,000 cycles, giving us an indication of what the performance of the fabric will be after three years of use. Nothing gets by the Olinator. So this is the characteristic that we want to see, is we want to see an ever decreasing amount of fiber loss, so that we will know that over a period of time, the loss of fiber will stabilize and the fabric will still maintain a, an acceptable appearance that will be satisfactory to our customers. This is not working. I need to build a machine. The Olinator. If the results from the seat and back compression test show that there may be some deficiency in the fabric, particularly in regard to pile loss, seam separation, or fiber migration, we expose the fabric to an additional test, which is called the ingress egress test. This test simulates the up and down movement of a person sitting and then rising from a piece of furniture. This is a 180 pound weight simulating the lower back and leg area and it provides a much more dramatic result in regard to where. We don't want to give you a wimpy fabric. 